As we grow older, our priorities change. We look back at the good times and the bad, and our purpose in life becomes clearer, bit by bit. I was not born rich. I was born right here in Belé Karikou and raised by my grandmother. When I was growing up, we did not have electricity. We did not have a man in the house to work the land. Life was hard. I remember what it was like to go to bed hungry. I remember my grandmother struggling to find opportunities to earn an income as we awaited the boxes of foodstuff that my mother would send by the boats from Trinidad. A struggling single mother, she did what she could to take care of her family. Growing up, my family instilled in us the values of caring for each other and doing unto others as we would like done unto us. It is this upbringing that defines my passion and my purpose. So when I see a government that puts fattening their pockets ahead of the needs of the people, my heart aches. When I visit the General Hospital and see the shortage of doctors, when I hear about the cost of tests and I hear from the nurses their frustration over the lack of basic medicines, it pains me because I know that more can be done. Under Keith Mitchell and the NNP, the people are struggling to get by. While they get rich, the people suffer from no jobs and no opportunities. And all too often, the people who do get the jobs don't get them because they're the most qualified. They get them because they have the links. That's not fair. If you have the skills, the talent, and the qualifications, you should get the job. For over 22 years, Keith Mitchell and the NNP made themselves and their friends rich while people suffered and struggled. It's time to lift our people out of poverty and create jobs. It's time for the NDC because we put people first.